Hi guys, this is Sumit from Game Zonker, and today uh, I'm going to discuss about the uh, very good added feature of the Injustice 2, the Operation Mode. We do not have this mode available in Injustice God Among Us, so it's a very good uh, for the beginner, and uh, you can increase the uh, experience of the player or hero without playing any game in any format whatsoever available here on injustice 2 so under this mode we have a uh, uh, three default operations so just let me uh, take you to that one um, okay so uh, here you can see i have uh, sent a three uh, uh, of my player already and the uh, operation is already completed for them okay so just uh, I'll just show you uh, uh, how uh, the player looks after gaining an experience. So if I just let me uh, tap on uh, tap to the uh, collect the rewards. Okay. And uh, after this, I will just talk uh, in detail. Uh, to let you know how uh, we can use this uh, option. So you can see uh, uh, the Wonder Woman actually reached the level 15. Okay. And uh, let me just check this out. How it cool. Yeah, she also reached the 15 one. And uh, she only uh, searched for me. Well, yeah, that's kind of okay. So that's kind of patient. Let's see uh, what's that one brought for me. Okay, so this guy brought over an additional uh, uh, shirts. So continue here. Okay, so these are default screen. So once you uh, let me just go back and uh, uh, take you in again. Okay, so here's an operation on the uh, left side uh, bottom. You just need to touch that one, and uh, you can see we have a three default uh, operations available. Okay, it's all means that you can assign a three different player. Uh, you cannot uh, send more than that one. But don't you worry, uh, as you uh, uh, keep increasing the operation level, you keep upgrading and you keep upgrading your player. And uh, by doing that, uh, then you can get more and more option to add uh, more player to the operation. So just let me uh, take you to the operation here. Mm. Okay, I clicked on the plus. So here you can see uh, two is highlighted, two operations are highlighted actually and the rest all are grayed out. It's because uh, uh, you require the uh, threats to qualify for that particular operation. Okay, So if you don't have any player who qualifies for that operation then uh, it will remain grayed out. But uh, for other you can see it's highlighted. Okay, So let me just talk about the first one because that is for the very big map. So here you can see it's required the threat level of one. Okay. So I have a seven play here. Okay. So it's required a threat level of one. And uh, so all the player whosoever is there in the team is eligible for this one. The next one is required 1000 threat level. And uh, I have only five. And so none of the 2000. And you can see that. Okay. But so for the different operations, we have a different. Uh, 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 time required to complete okay so you can see the duration so it is showing that the 27 minutes and 16 seconds so by default it is 30 minutes so i just upgraded it to the level 6 that's why uh, the time is reduced by 10 percent similar for the uh, next operation and you can see the all other operations have the similar uh, situations but as uh, uh, you can see the third level is increasing the duration is also increasing okay so it means that if you're sending a player uh, who actually uh, very experienced then uh, it may gain a very good experience if you send him for the uh, longer hours okay so that's how it is so let me just uh, get into the first operation okay um, so here you can see uh, seven players of mine and uh, uh, you can see three of them is showing as assigned to the team and uh, other not so i'll just tell you how it's going to happen okay so let me just put uh, okay. Robin. 
yeah drop in okay so i'll just put my uh, drop in on this one so you, you can see that the sending robin uh, on an operation will remove them from your team i'm okay with that thank you okay i'm just going to click on a continue so here you can see a warning message like you are about to send robin on an operation a robin will be unavailable for the duration of this operation it is because so once you send that particular plate to, uh, to the operation you cannot move phone player from the game okay so uh, so you choose that when you want to keep them idle or just uh, work, newly join your team you can say and send those players to this operation and uh, without playing any game you can uh, increase the experience of them okay so i am just sending the second one okay I'm second I set player to the uh, second operation I think uh, just to show you. Um, okay, thank you. So I've sent all my uh, three players right to the operation and you can see the duration have started reducing. Okay. So after half an hour of close to 2016 it uh, um, they will come back and I would see the increase in their experience as well as I would earn money out of that which is good okay and uh, i'll just tell you but this idea is very good uh, trust me because uh, uh, in in just a record among us we have uh, so many players available but we cannot utilize uh, every player to uh, increase their experience okay uh, but in in that game we have uh, uh, very good feature available with the help of uh, this it's a trick actually uh, with the help of which we can uh, increase the experience okay i may make another video to let you know how to do that in uh, god among us okay so that is all for now so thanks for watching please comment share like and subscribe to my channel uh, to get more updates on injustice game and other games as well thank you for watching have a good day bye bye